I'm often asked whether in using my products you can achieve too high levels of the B vitamins, whether you can achieve unsafe levels or dangerous or toxic levels of B vitamins. Uh, the answer is no. I take many if not most of my products and the levels of B vitamins in each of those products has been designed assuming that like me, you now take many of our products. If you look back at my multivitamins from say 30 plus years ago, because at that time we were really just making multivitamins. We weren't making all these ancillary products that we add B complex vitamins to, but the levels of multivitamins in those multi, the levels of B vitamins in those multivitamins were literally 10 to 20 times higher than today. So understanding that, say our typical multivitamin would have 100 milligrams of B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, B12, as much as 500 or 1,000 micrograms. Those levels have all been decreased over the years because we've been, number one, able to validate that we could achieve healthy blood levels with lower levels. Also, because like me, many of you take multiple products. So say in our CoQ10 today, or in some of our, our ultimate will, women's wellness, our, our memory and brain, we have several products that we must add B-complex vitamins to. Why? It might be the only product you take. And if it's the only product you take, the ingredients that are de delivering those benefits require that B-complex vitamins accompany them. CoQ10, as critical as CoQ10 is for energy production, you can't produce energy without the rest of the B-complex and most certainly B12. But the levels are now typically between five milligrams and 10 milligrams. Remember before our multivitamins had over 100. Our typical multivitamins today are be between 10 and 25 milligrams. So even if you're taking a dozen of my products, you're probably not achieving the same B complex levels as you did 30 years ago with my multivitamin. So again, this is something that we have paid attention to everything. This is something we would not miss. Certainly I would not miss it because I'm taking all of these products myself. So it was an opportunity for us because we are constantly changing our products. In most cases, as frequently as once a year, not changing the look of the label and making it prettier, but changing the actual formula. In fact, all of my formulas in the last several years have been changed in terms of the form of folic acid that we use. We use a special form because if you're like me, I'm one of that minority of the population that can't metabolize typical folic acid. So we have our new methylfolate that all of us can metabolize. Also, uh, we use a special form of B12 that no one else in the world has. Some might be using a coenzyme form of methylfolate, but only ours is absorption protected. So we've made all these changes recently in terms of our B-complex and B12. But of course, we have been decreasing steadily the levels of B-complex and B12 in all our formulas because we know, looking at everyone's behavior out there, that like me, you're taking multiple formulas. And even if you're only taking one formula, our B-complex vitamins are so much more efficient in terms of absorption that you can rest assured that even if you're taking our CoQ10, you're getting B-complex vitamins in a bioavailable form and a bioactive dose. So again, no need to worry whatsoever. Even if you're taking multiple formulas like Ultimate Women's Wellness and Memory and Brain, and even if you're taking two or three CoQ10 every day, and if you're taking alpha lipoid acid, and if you're also taking our Essential One multivitamin, you are still not approaching anywhere near a level of, of toxicity. It, it's not even close to the levels we used to have 30 years ago, where we stay far away from anything being potentially toxic. And, and of course, with the B-complex vitamins, one of the biggest problems with them is the rapidity, how rapidly they are excreted from the body. That unfortunately is a big problem with the B-complex vitamins because the typical American diet doesn't have a ready supply, a readily available supply of B-complex vitamins. So what little we get from food, we get rid of just as quickly. They have what's called a very short half-life. A half-life in terms of uh, nu nutrients or half-life in terms of medications is the amount of time with, in which it takes your body to process half of that nutrient or half of that medication. B-complex vitamins have a very rapid half-life, unfortunately, which means we are called upon to constantly, constantly replenish them. 
So again, that underscores why the levels of B-complex in our formulas are absolutely not problematic. Even if you're getting B-complex in, as I said, more than a dozen of my products, that still will not be equivalent to the levels of B-complex in one multivitamin from 30 years ago, 35 years ago. So again, not to worry. This has all been taken into consideration. We assume that like me, uh, many of you or most of you are using multiple formulas, at least a half a dozen formulas or more. And again, the reason why the B-complex formula, B-complex is in each of those individual formulas, it must be done ethically because that might be the only formula you take. And if so, we need to make sure that a critical component in the efficacy of that formula, the B-complex and B12 are vital for brain function. It has to be in memory and brain. Vital for energy production has to be in our CoQ10 formula. So again, that is why we do it, but we've taken this into consideration. We only make our formulas in a responsible, ethical, and completely safe fashion.